We're on the edge right now. Look at how crazy that is. What's up, boys and girls? Tucker Doss here, and it is another exciting day to be alive. Well, it's moderately exciting, right, Scout? Yes. Yeah. We got kicked out of our camping spot at 4... 20 or like 4 30 a.m. <sighs> Sunrise is at 7. Is it the brink of like, is it too late to find another camping spot, set the tent back up, and go back to sleep? Because it's like by the time we do that, it's gonna be maybe 6, you know? And then at 6 o'clock, like you might as well be up. Right now, we're debating what to do. And I think we're gonna go back up to the canyon that we tried to go to two vlogs ago to see if we can get a better view of it because last time it was just socks and clouds, and maybe this time it'll be better. I'm trying to try to keep our head up. No rain though. You know, this is just a thought this guy woke us up and I'm thinking anything that happens today from now on is because of us getting woken up at 4 30 because we wouldn't be going where we're going or doing what we're doing had we not been woken up so early I'm gonna probably put my head down for like 30 minutes and try to close my eyes for a bit because we're super close to where we're going and the Sun won't rise for another hour so I'm gonna do that Finally, now I can switch to the wide camera. The wide camera is just terrible with low light, so it's it's brighter now. Also worth noting, my shoes are just off because my Converse are so annoying to put back on and off. But we made it to the top of this canyon here. A little annoyed that I have to use the iPhone. The iPhone's still great. You know, the, the, at the end of the day, the best camera is the one with you. It's a great quote, but damn. Wait, look at this. Wow, we can actually see stuff and we're not getting just railed by rain. That's nice. Hopefully when we continue down the road, we can see the Nepali coast because that's, uh, that's something I've wanted to see the whole time and we haven't really seen it. Should I have PB it though? I don't know, it's a little too mystical. Maybe I'll go stand on the top of that and see what it looks like. All right, we gotta park, this could be cool. Scout, how you feeling? You feeling, uh, you look like you're tired. The 4.30 a.m. wake up is really just <laughs> us right up. Hey! We did it. That was easier than I thought. We only had to battle one spider. Now we just gotta wait for this fog to clear up a bit. You see how fast this weather changes? The fog is just moving everywhere, so I wanna be as ready as I can to just hit go. That's amazing. I should be flying right now! What am I doing? This is perfect! <laughs> Scout standing up on this point. I'm, uh, I'm gogged up. Let's do it. Stream on that one and my uh, my drone is not that powerful. I got a new one that's supposed to be really really good But I haven't figured it out yet. So I tried Shut up. All right, let's go This is a better start to this experience than we had last time last time It was just pouring rain and uh, This time it's looking like maybe we'll see something I don't want to I don't want to get too excited though because we've been stripped of all the joy of seeing things over the last five or six days however long we've been here but do you think that we would have come back if we wouldn't have been like woken up this morning? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Never mind. I think we're gonna see it. I think we're gonna see it. I think we're gonna see it. Yeah. There it is. That's what we came all the way all this way for. The rooster. Oh nice. There it is. That's cool. You can actually see some blue in the water down there. This is actually unbelievable. I, I'm a, I'm at a loss for words right now. More just because we were actually seeing something on this trip. Scott and I are going on a little hike. See if we can't get a better vantage point. Worth noting, don't go on it unless you have some sort of experience and have hiking boots at least because it could be sketch. So a little disclaimer for you there. We're gonna go see what we can find. It's okay, mom, I saw Sam Calder do it. I don't know if this is the end. I don't think it is, but we made it somewhere cool looking. Damn, this is so beautiful. All right. trail a bit more came across this this would be like such an epic camp spot oh you just have to figure out what to do with your car because there's no overnight camping but wow uh dibs look at how crazy that is 
Wow. Yeah, definitely would not do this if it was raining. That's so sketch. Look at this view. Look at, we got these little canyons down here. Well, little, massive canyons down here and these really cool trees. And I'm thinking, I take this guy, start it like right up here, shoot through these trees. Maybe that one if I'm feeling saucy, but no. And then dive down into the canyon. How are we feeling about that? Feeling like I can do it? I don't know if I'm feeling like I can do it. We'll try. All we can do is try. I put my backpack on this bush here to take off the drone from and then hopefully go through that. We'll see. Here we go. <laughs> that you watched yesterday because I'm behind. Scott and I made it to a coffee shop and we're working. Just got the vlog out super late, but hey, you know, at least it's out. I need to shave so bad we should go to the showers again today. Okay. I look like a caveman. A caveman who can't actually grow a beard. <laughs> Oh my god! The wide camera gets so shitty at night. We're at the beach trying to soak up a day full of no rain. Such a nice day. I apologize for all the noise you're getting in this shot, but we're going back to Seattle tomorrow. You have one more vlog after this to deal with the iPhone, so I'm sorry. We're at this camp spot, and there's showers here, and we're gonna shower because we dirty. We nay. Oh my god, look at around the edges. I'm sorry. This isn't the Tucker Doss quality that you're looking for. You know, it is what it is. It is with the D's. Showers. Last meal. Super good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Last night in the camping rig. Scout and I just had debatably like the, it was such an expensive meal and it was the pinnacle of our trip, really. It was, it was kind of like uh, a bland. It was like, on paper, it looked really good, and it was expensive, and it looked like it was gonna be a good time, but it was just a terrible, terrible meal. And uh, <laughs> Scout and I were cracking up laughing because it was just like, it described our trip. It, it was a good trip. We had a good trip. It was it fun. Was it trip. was fun. We, But it was just like, as far as the rain goes, it really just <laughs> us over on so many things that we wanted to do. We barely even went in the water. Kind of a bummer, but. Oh well, you know, there's there's more life and there's more time to experience things these yeah. things on another time. So we'll be back. We'll be back for sure. Um, maybe not to this island <laughs> at this time of the year again, but I don't. Anyways, that's gonna do it for today's vlog, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, make sure to like the video. Uh, you also need to subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, above all else, Scott, what do they what do they need to have? Let's see if you can get this right this time. What do they need to have above all else? Um, they need to have a good time. You're f***ing with me. <laughs> Make sure to live the life that you want to. And have, and your have a great rest of your day. And have a great rest of your day. Because life is too, too short, short not, not to. to. Alright. <laughs> we'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace. I mean, are you kidding me? We're like on a volcano right now.